Hi guys, I'm Jason Simmons, a cock and cook. And today I'm talking about chicken stock. No, I'm not talking about a music festival for hen parties. I'm talking about this kind of thing. Right, now using one of these is perfectly respectable. And if we haven't got a lot of time, I think we've all used them. But a lot of recipes say use a good chicken stock. So what do they mean by a good chicken stock and how do we make it? Well, what they mean is this bad boy, because this is the real deal. But how do we make the real deal? We make it like the video coming up. But before we show you the video, firstly, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to tell all your mates to subscribe as well. Also, like the video, hit the little bell. You know the score, I've got to say it. Anyway, get that out of the way. What you'll see is in the recipe I'm using fresh chicken, but after your Sunday lunch, you're left with a carcass, you're left with the bones, you're left with all those bits and pieces. You can use those instead. They would go in the bin, but you will make an absolute stonking stock. It will be a blinder anyway, trust me. So, that's enough chatting. How'd you make it? Like this. For the recipe, pause it now. Okay, take your chicken carcass. Like I say, you could use a cooked one. I've cut mine in half to fit it in the pan. Once that's in there, add one celery stick, add one onion, and one carrot, two bay leaves, and six peppercorns. Now you want to cover it in water, roughly one and a half litres of water, but this doesn't have to be exact. Right, put it on the hob and gently bring it to the boil. As it starts coming to the boil, you'll see some scum will come to the top. Use a spoon and take this off. Now what you'll find is, as it cooks, more will come to the top and all you do is spoon it off. Okay, once it's boiling, turn the heat right down as low as it will go. Put it back on the heat and you want to cook it for two to two and a half hours until it's reduced by over half. Go two and a half hours later, you can see it's re reduced right down. Right now, turn it off the heat, put a lid on, and let it cool down. Once it's cooled down, put it through a strainer, lift all your bits out, and get your liquid, and then put your liquid through a fine sieve straight into a jug. jug of deliciousness and there we have our fabulous freshly made chicken stock and that is a company cook production <laughs>